would give us something to do at least. Let's form an alliance with him. And we'll call him into that war. Like to press our de jour claim here, yes, and thank you. Like to call you to arms. How many troops do you have? 1,900. Do you have enough? Let's have him fight the war for us. His job is to hunt the enemy. Now we're not going to do that. We'll raise our own holding troops and leave our levies out of it. Oh, especially since he hired troops. Okay. Then we'd rather have you attached to us, I think. Oh, good stuff. Extra tithe. I don't like where you're going. I don't like your trajectory. Well, I suppose we can just meet there. Let's just wait for him here. He'll attach. Then we move down here and attack from the south. No, we were defeated. What a very unfortunate and unforeseen event of line of events. How many kids do you have? How many sons? You have one legitimate son. Quite honestly. Right, who's leading? This guy leads center because organization, this guy goes flank and we go also flank. To then take over any siege work that needs doing. So why did we call in this king? Because him not really liking us all that much doesn't matter. At the end of the day, what does matter to us is the allies that we can call into internal wars, which is not him. So a war against any of our fellow dukes we can't call him into it doesn't matter to us oh no he's being attacked our enemy is being attacked by someone for something not the same thing i hope no it's a subjugation war that's even worse because we're not going to be able to take this stuff we have to siege his uh, capital to prevent him from sieging the capital that annoys me a little bit, because that means he can pretty much freely take out our stuff here. I mean, I say annoy, but that's a nuisance. And you want to vassalize this guy now. So, at least he doesn't get the chance to mess with us, because he's now fending off our liege as well. Come on, just surrender to, to us. Going to lose a little bit less. How many troops does he have? 800, so he has a chance to defeat those. But of course he goes back to sieging us. Instead of doing something sensible with his time. We need to initiate this battle there. 
Okay, we've gotten the siege. So now if we initiate this battle there, it should go onto our war account, so to speak. But we will have the support of the troops coming in. We might be able to siege this out as well. Don't think so, but... Alright, there we go. That's 100%. And apparently we only got these things and not this because this was still taken by someone else. Great. That's the good stuff. That's the good stuff right there. I've seen this sometimes before, not very often. But it's always a great joy when it happens. Don't forget to bet a spy master. Come on, let's see if we can't find a real good spy master somewhere in the world. To help us here. 17. But we can't go with anyone who hates us. What do you want us to do? Temple, no. I was about to say I don't have the money for it, but looking at the money we have, we do have actually money. So let's go plus 5% on everything here. That's good. And there's our new spy master. Very well. Go help. That increases our plot power by 8%. Try and take out this matrilineal marriage. Okay, so the Seljuks have emerged somehow. Uh, but they're this. These are the Seljuks. This is the Great Seljuk Empire, which has this name now. But apparently they are the Seljuks. Okay then, if you say so. Only subjugated these two cities, this is just... just fantastic. Ah, uh, go away. Want to do what you say. Go this way, you have something there. You're fighting these guys? You're part of an empire, so you are being attacked. Prepared invasion. That might be difficult for you. But you have this ally here. It's good, I suppose. Right, and we can't go again. Because we would be a truce breaker. <laughs> Oh boy. This strange world is truly strange in every single sense of the word. Hey, can we declare to subjugate you? No. Okay, there's a plan at least to kill our daughter in law. Sadly, our plot was revealed. It did not work. 
Six percent for how much? Oh, that's fairly cheap. Okay, he died. So that's good. Sunny boy, into court you come. How are you a higher tier than me? He's back. Good stuff. Let's get you a proper woman, eh? Attractive one? Uh, geniuses. Okay, let's go by age then. Something mid-range. Slightly used. Oh, she's really good. 22. That's not bad at all. So we might want someone to complement the diplomacy side even further. Doesn't look good though. Like, she's really the best option here. Let's get her. Okay. Now you get some prestige out of it too. I mean, our plot to kill her was revealed, but only she knew that we were coming for her. Which also means... No one on aggression pact. How many troops do you have? 5,000 something. Why are we in this? Oh, we're an ally to this. Can we even declare war then? No. Yes, we can. What is this? Silly stuff is what it is. All these kings down here really hold together. Let's make bad choices again, which we will regret inevitably. girls doesn't have any girls oh boys runner you need boys to fit with girls how old she 13 he's too old probably no other cast just trying to find a few kings here somewhere outside dukes would also help These are the best alliances because dukes generally don't interact in outside wars much. They are not going to call us in into anything. So he is off to fight this army there. We already hired some troops. Where are you with your troops? Up there, so far away. Far, far away from us. And you will be encountering an invader there.
really wonder what it will do. I don't know what it will do. If we win the war, we gain the kingdom of Fragiania. Yeah. Sounds about right. And we have a bunch of dukes joining us here. All together with us. Should potentially that's 1,800. So 2,600. 3,400 and our own almost 1,500 and he's far away so we get to go ahead with sieges before he even really gets to do anything about this Everyone joins. And we are a siege leader ourselves, so we can, like, instantly walk into here. Nothing stopping us from doing it because we know his troops are in the north. Is turning around, though. A bit unfortunate for us. Get everyone to attach. We must lead. Is this jungle? No, it's plains. I feel like bringing in a few troops. A few hired troops. really feel like bringing in some higher troops here. Can't afford them for long. So we would need to time it well. Maybe we can resurrect some all the lions to call in more people I think they're already there maybe with a gift but that would take away our ability to raise mercenaries okay yeah there's another old alliance Join us, brother. Joining. That's another few hundred. Alright, so he's clearly gunning for us. Stop messing about with my troop orders here. Stop it. So this could work. We have 5,000 when he arrives and another 400 coming. He only has another two. So it's going to be pretty much even. I think the center should be this guy. Doesn't really matter. Not a great difference between us. All right, okay.
raising people now would be too late. This is very unfortunate. A ruler switched out our leader, so this flank is going to break and thus we lose the battle. Yep, there we go. Battle lost. Not the war yet, but the battle was clearly lost. Very hard as well, which is deeply unfortunate. I was hoping, hoping really strongly that he would go for the invader threat first, but he's not for some reason. And he's, he's hunting us. He's hunting us down. Okay. So there's nothing for it. Either we go with this now or we're done. Uh, so let's get these guys again. All right. And everyone attached to us, please. That was deeply unfortunate on every single level. Who died? Uh, court chaplain. I don't know. Court physician does now. Right, so he's taking out our allies as well. Is there somewhere with jungle that we can wait for our troops? Here. He's not doing what I expected him to do, so we're losing this one hard. And he's also coming for us again. Not. Oh, we could go on the attack. But we've already proven that it's not the best idea for us to do. Let's get people of a, a little bit higher rank in here. Ah. Uh, okay, let's fight another. If if we lose this, we're just going to surrender. He deserves the win, and we do. He has a 32 commander there. Yeah, that's no wonder why we're losing. Let's just surrender. I don't know what it does to us, but I don't care. We've lost this. Fair and square. We tried. We really, really failed and fell on our face extremely hard. Had we just waited, had we just waited for him to actually engage with the invader threat, then we might have had a chance, but not the way we handled this one. Deserved loss. Very much deserved. Nothing more to it. And now we're going to find a whole bunch of people being annoyed. And he wants us in his war now. Sure, everyone is calling us in now. What are you fighting over? I don't really want to send anything to anyone, so I'm not going to. Especially since we're hard deficit right now, so that's really bad for us. In many, many ways. And of course, there are now dangerous factions. No wonder. Can't send a gift because we're super in, in the negative. Oh boy, what have we done? 